The 16th annual Judy's Place for Kids Run with Courage 5K is returning to downtown Pikeville Saturday, April 13th. The 5K is open to runners and walkers and registration will remain open until the race begins. Yeah, the Run with Courage is, you know, it's, it's one of many 5Ks um, that we do here in Pikeville, um, but it is one of the first ones that actually started and it's, it's had a long history of a lot of awesome community support and we're very appreciative of that. Um, but the whole thing is themed around this idea of this uh, courage and superheroes um, and just this, this idea that anyone that has to face any sort of abuse or neglect um, in their life, you know, any, anyone that has to go through that is someone that is a superhero in our eyes because um, it takes a lot of courage and um, just ability to be able to, or just overall just a lot of courage to be able to go through those kinds of things. And so um, we like to bring a lot of recognition to that as well as to the people that serve kids. We, we fully believe that those people are also superheroes um, with the amount of courage and determination and compassion that they use as well. Make your ride one of a kind and see the experts at JM Custom Auto and Off Road. It's your customization candy store. Visit jmcustomauto.com and select your make and model. It's that easy. Window tinting, remote starts, leather interiors, sound systems, front and rear bumpers, spray in bed liners, bed covers, wheels and tires, lift kits, step rails, even under glow light kits, and so much more. If you can dream it, we can do it at JM Custom. The race will begin at 9 a.m., and to be guaranteed a race t-shirt, participants must register no later than March 22nd. We, we had quite a big, big cut in funding last year from the federal level, and we're expecting to have even more cuts. Um, and that's not just our center, that's nationwide, um, Children's Advocacy Centers and other centers like ours. Um, and so it's very important that we, we, we work to kind of fill those gaps of that, that funding by continuing to increase our fundraising efforts in the community. Um, right now, I mean, fundraising does make up a decent portion of what allows us to do what we do, to be able to pay our staff, to be able to um, have supplies, to have snacks on hand for kids um, that come in our office. Um, and so it's just very important that we have this funding, and um, it's becoming even more important with other funding going away. For more information and to register, go to Judy's Place for Kids on Facebook. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.